It has been a deadly week in the city of Birmingham. At least five homicides just since the start of this week. And Birmingham's police chief addressing that violence right here on WBRC. Here's our map that shows you the different locations of those five homicides just since Monday. The latest on Hemlock Avenue. Our Josh Gant tonight live with more on how police and community groups are working to try and end this violence, Josh. Jonathan Police Chief Scott Thurman says the violence this week is disturbing. He's calling on more help from the community. Meanwhile, the community is calling on more resources to help get to the root of the problem. It's people, places, and behaviors. It's what we've seen in these last five and what we see a number, a number of our homicides every year. Birmingham Police Chief Scott Thurman in our studio Thursday calling the five murders just this week alone unacceptable. People are engaging in activities that they shouldn't be engaging in, illegal activities with people that they shouldn't be, you know, hanging out with. And oftentimes these result in violence. You know, when we look at the five that occurred over the last few days, we have a lot of that. You know, all these occurred in residential areas. Three occurred inside a residence, which is very hard for law enforcement to prevent things that occur inside a private residence. Thurman says police can't be everywhere and they need the community's help now more than ever. You have to be each other's keeper to a degree as well. And let us know before things occur. If, if, if things are escalating somewhere, we need to know about it so we can intervene before it escalates to violence and someone loses their life. We recently sat in on a conversation about gun violence. The community groups discuss what drives it and solutions to combat it. Right now, gun violence is at an all-time high, and what we're looking at is that persons in between the ages of 19 and 39 are those that are directly impacted the most. However, those that are actually losing their lives to gun violence here in Birmingham, the ages are even, getting even lower. Organizers say there are strategies cities can implement to try and reduce gun violence, including identifying people in groups at the highest risk for gun violence, implementing hospital-based violence intervention programs, street outreach, and curing violence by changing community norms. They are not the only ways to prevent violence. And yet these are strategies that can work to most immediately intervene and interrupt cycles of violence. We're told BPD plans to install 50 cameras around the city, hoping that will help fight crime. Uh, but Chief uh, Thurman says that they need help from the public and entire community partnership here to keep things safe. Live in Birmingham tonight, I'm Josh Gant, WBRC, Fox 6 News on your side.